We all have our pet peeves on airplane flights. Sometimes it's a person snoring right behind you. That's no or good. Or beside a, you. Yeah, or a baby screaming <laughs> behind you, a kid kicking your chair. A oh. flight attendant, though, recently saw something that just she would just wouldn't stand for. WWT's mm. Jordan Shefty joins us now live to explain. Jordan, good morning and happy birthday. <laughs> Thank you, Dave. Hey, good morning, you guys. Airplane rides can sometimes be long, stressful, and it doesn't often bring out the best in us. Now, as if shoes on the armrests, bare feet on the tray table, ponytail over the screen aren't bad enough. How about a headstand on an aisle seat. Another passenger on the plane captured this passenger limbering up on a two hour United flight from LA to Mexico. He started to live tweet making up names for the moves, but when she started to do a second handstand, that's when the flight attendant intervened. The lady doing the headstand told the flight attendant she wasn't feeling well. Now, this comes at the same time that American Airlines has launched a new campaign showing how the world's greatest flyers are supposed to behave. What is that? I mean, that was a pillowcase around oh. his head. That's one I way to mean, get an aisle seat. A, a headstand <laughs> in the seat. And she was able to do it while the person next to her stayed sleeping. She actually really did. It makes good sense, like, on maybe good. an eight hour flight, but come on, two hours. Two hours. Yeah, that's let's ridiculous. Get, what's, what's your let's biggest pet peeve? The kicking kid. Kicking? Oh, they can't see. help it. The ki no, yes, you can. Aww. The kicking kid? I don't like the loud the talkers. <laughs> or, you can hear them or somebody like five that just wants to talk to you when you're trying to sleep. Either way. All right, we've got to go.